Hey, this is Cakes and Shakes. And in today's video, I get asked all the time, how are you so rich? How did you get such awesome pets? How do you have so much money? I, as you can see, I have over 300,000 uh, adopt me bucks right now. And the, there's a whole bunch of tricks that I wanna teach you on how to get rich and adopt me. So the first one is, and how to get more money, is, uh, and you can see I've got Blue Boy Tiger Pup here with me to help demonstrate and show us some of these tricks. But the first trick is, is actually really simple. So if you, pay, if you play as a baby, you get money. And if you play as an adult, oops, if you play as an adult, see, I can switch to baby, but I'm not gonna do but that. You go into, uh, you go into dress up, switch in, into baby, and you play as a baby. When you play as a baby, you get extra bucks. So I highly recommend if you're trying to rack up dollars, play as a baby. Um, That's, that is tip number one. What's the next tip, Blue Boy? The next tip is always have a pet out when getting needs. That's right. So you always want to have your pet out getting needs. If you don't have a pet out, your pet's not going to get needs and therefore you're not going to be able to feed them or give them water, which is how you get bucks. So always have your pet out while you're playing. That's it. That's a really important trick. The next one, and, and we'll go here and demonstrate here. I've got, uh, I actually have three pets out right now, but uh, we're gonna just uh, teleport over to the uh, Blue Boy. Let's go to gifts and then we'll teleport over to the it's, salon. It's more useful to teleport to the vehicles. Yeah, you could do that too. I, I'm, this is what I'm doing. But So we're going over to the salon. Another way to get box and to really rack up bucks quick is to come in here and work at either the salon or the pizza place. So this is the salon. This is how you come over and you, uh, and you work. And you can see up here this little dial here. Every time the green goes all the way around, it will pay you money for being a worker in the salon. And so that's another great way to get to get bucks and to get rich so that you can buy stuff. So we'll close out of here. I'm also going to show you how to do that in the pizza, the pizza place. So then come over here. Here's the pizza place. And if you go in here, if you come back here and do the same thing, just sign up here, become a waitress. What, they're closed at night, but during the day they're open and you will get 10 bucks for each, you know, short a couple, a minute or two. So that's, a, that's another uh, great way to get bucks. Come on, shakes, come with me and my phoenixes that I'm trying to grow and make a neon. All right, um, uh, let's see, Blue Boy, what's the next one on, what's the next tip to give? Do so things on your task board. And if you look to your left on your screen, then you'll see a button for the task board. Yep, that's right. So. Right here is your task board. And if you do these things, right, if I collect a toy that isn't already in my journal, I get 40 bucks. If I dress up a pet with a new accessory, I get 30 bucks. So if I do those tasks, then it will give me, uh, it will give me those, those bucks. Right now you can see I'm um, putting my phoenixes to bed. I'm doing a task that will give me bucks for, for doing that. So that is the next thing, do the task board. Um, you know, this is pretty obvious, but if you have a pet out, do all the needs. That will give you the most, the most bucks. So right now I am uh, picking up my pets and I'm, we're gonna actually go back to uh, my house. And oh, by the way, I will mention this in another in another video, but it's very worth it to get the um, the magic door because you're able to transport to your house uh, really quickly and it, it gets you around really quickly. So now I'm just doing, I'm doing needs, right? I'm doing my showers. Uh, but what's the next uh, tip, Blue Boy? Um, you have to no, do all of your... Nope. Pet needs. No, we already said that. And you have to buy in money tree. Yeah. So as you can see right here, 
this is what they call a money tree. And if you, yep, right where Blue Boy is. Money trees will give you up to $100 a day. So all you do to buy a money, money tree is you go into Edit House, you go to Stuff, and you search on money. And when you do that, the money tree will pop up. Now, the money trees are pretty expensive. They're $1,450. But if you think about it, a money tree will give you $100 a day. So after playing for 14 and a half days, or for, we'll just say 15 days, two weeks, you will have paid for your money tree and you will get a hundred bucks a day forever. So I highly recommend getting the money trees. The next tip is, and this one might be, we're gonna actually transport to, cause we gotta do the needs. We're gonna transport to the school here and do my school need. But the next one is, you know, occasionally like they just had a couple of weeks ago, they'll do two times growing and money weekends. So that's a great time to both grow and to make money. So I highly recommend uh, doing those. What's the next tip, Blue Boy? The next one is make a growing house and you can make it in a room in your house if you have a lot of rooms. Yeah, so the tip here is make either a growing house, which is the one that you just saw. My, I have a small house that I'm gonna teleport to here as soon as my school need is done, where uh, I've got basically all the needs except for the orange needs. So these orange needs, you actually have to go somewhere to do, but it allows you to do all of the needs other than the orange needs right in your own, right in your own, right in your own house. So um, what we're gonna do right now is I'm gonna get out my magic door again. I am gonna transport back to my house. And I just wanna show you what I mean. This is what I mean when I say I have a growing house. So I bought beds. When I went in and edited my house, I'd come in and here, I'd say it's stuff, and I'd say, hey, I want a bed. So I bought a bed. So there's all these bed options. So I, what I did for each one of these is I went in and I bought beds. I bought food and, and water for the pets. I bought showers. I bought, uh, uh, I bought um, water so I can come in here and get water. Over here I have pizzas. So I've got pizzas that I can get and over here's my money tree. I also bought pianos. So the pianos are the one orange need that take care of the playground need. And if you buy pianos, you don't actually have to go to the playground. You can take care of that. I also have these cauldrons that give you speed potions and also jump jump potions. Oops, stop editing. And uh, the jump potions help you jump higher. The speed potions, you may wonder why I'm running so fast. Well, I'm using speed potions and that helps you get around, um, it helps you get around Adopt Me Land a lot quicker and therefore you can earn money quicker as well. So I always use speed potions. In fact, when I'm not using speed potions, I feel like I'm going so slow. <laughs> All right, so Blue Boy, what's the next one that we have that we have on our list? The next one is to take out your lemonade stand, your cotton candy stand, or your hot dog stand. That's right, why don't you do that and demonstrate? All right. So you can see Blue Boy has a, he has a hot dog stand and you can buy these with Robux or trade for them and then put them out in the town square or wherever you want, but it's a great way. I used to always put these out every time I played. As soon as I got out, I would put out my hot dog stand and I would buy a hot dog from Blue Boy. Here we go, I paid him 50 bucks and it's a great way, I'm actually gonna buy three of them. You have to set it to the highest price to get the, a lot of money. Yeah, the, you know, you could put them at a dollar, you can put them whatever, but I always put them at $20 or $50. You can also do a lemonade stand or a cotton candy stand um, because, you know, at the end of the day, a dollar is not going to get you very rich, but if you put them at higher prices, people will still, will still buy them. Like this, this girl in our video was saying she would buy one for a dollar. Um, so that's the next tip. And then the, uh, the other tip that I'll mention here too, is you can see I've got shakes right here, right? Which I'm gonna ride. But I also have these two phoenixes because I'm making a neon phoenix. And uh, so how do I do that? Well, I actually have three devices. So I'm able to grow three pets. I'm able to get three times as much gold or, uh, or bucks. 
and I grow my pets three times faster. So I highly recommend that in terms of getting more bucks and also growing your pets fast. If you have five devices, you can do five. If you have 10 devices, you could do 10 at a time. Three is, is kind of all I can handle, uh, but you know it, it is dependent on you having multiple uh, devices and multiple Ro, uh, Roblox accounts. So you have to sign up for multiple accounts. And then the last, the last thing that we have on our list for today, the last tip is uh, you can also become a taxi driver. So if you go to your, um, if you go to your vehicles, and you'll see, I should have a taxi in here somewhere. Oh, I actually don't have a taxi in this account. But in my other account, if you have a taxi, you can go and be a taxi driver and people will pay you to drive them around. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it helps you to know how to get rich and how to get uh, bucks faster. And good luck out there, like our video, and subscribe to our channel. Thanks. Bye!